Hey, beautifuls. I'm just Jackie is here. I know y'all like, girl, you is doing it, ain't you? Mm -hmm. I'm trying to get y'all content. Okay. But I was here. Listen, I told y'all I was going to test out this primer all week. Come back and let my beautifuls know how I'm feeling about this primer. So anyway, I'm calling this Sunday samples. So pretty much I'm going to try to do this um, once a week or whatever. I got enough samples to, to give y'all, you know, enough content, you know, for a hot minute, hot month or whatever, whatever. But anyway, it's called Sunday samples is when I go to Sephora or um, Ulta. But honestly, Ulta is not really forthcoming with samples so i let me know y'all get samples from ulta i don't so you know i'll be traveling to sephora uh getting samples either as needed you know like i said when i run out of samples i'll go back and get some more but it's going to be called it's like i said sunday samples i'm going to be trying a product all week and then i'll come back and let you let my beautiful know how i'm feeling about this product okay so if you've been watching my uh, if you watch my first video with the comeback don't call it a comeback but anyway we're gonna call it a comeback <laughs> you will know that i told you guys i was wearing the urban decay illusion primer okay so right here on the package one day the lighting will be per not perfect but anyway so it has so yeah and I, I i showed it to you guys on film so let me show it to you again but this is what the product looks like i told you guys in the previous video it really goes on like a moisturizing lotion it really goes on like a moisturizing lotion when it dries it does kind of have a film at first but um like when i was about to film to do the makeup video or whatever and i had the primer setting i got sidetracked and got caught up in some other stuff so my face had been primed for a minute so by the time i got back to here to actually record that white film was gone so eventually the white film kind of you know fades out or whatever whatever so um but yeah goes on smooth like a lotion it, let me see you honestly it smells like a uh, paste whatever um damn y'all remember when y'all was in like kindergarten or whatever and you had that that paste away. That, that's what it smells like. I mean, sorry, I can't give you a better description, but it smells like paste. Um, subtle paste. How about that? Because it's not a strong scent. I don't smell it when I put it on my face. Okay. So first of all, let me take, let me give you a little description from the Urban Decay website about what it says, you know, about the uh, illusion um, primer. And then I'll let you know if that's what I was, you know, my thoughts after trying this out for a week. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so product product description. Ready for the most perfected looking skin? Instantly blur flaws and smooth out your skin with optical illusion complexion primer. This primer reduces fine lines and makes pores seem to vanish for for a gorgeous porcelain like texture. Makeup not only goes on better but also lasts longer. This velvety soft, lightweight primer has a slight pink tint to illuminate skin pre makeup, but does but dries down to a translucent matte finish. Like the same, like the like the name suggests, optical illusion <laughs> creates an optical veil <laughs> of scattered light, giving skin a soft focus effect. Okay, the result a beautiful airbrush finish. No Photoshop skills necessary. Our cushy formula provides just enough glide to fill in lines for a smooth out complexion and dries down to the perfect powdery finish. Okay, in a clinically studied, uh, in a clinically study of optical illusion. Complexion primer. Immediately after use, 90% of the participants had a reduction in pore visibility. 90% had smoother looking skin. 93% had more even toned skin. 81% had visible reduction in fine lines and blemishes. Hmm. Okay. Based on a clinical grading in a 30 person study. 
This cushy formula contains optical blurring pigments for a beautifully perfected skin, a luxurious blend of argan, rose ship, and meadow foam seed oils. Oils providing moisturizing and antioxidant antioxidant benefits while vitamin E conditions. Mm. Optical Illusion Primer comes in a luxurious clear bottle with a metallicized gunmetal cap and base. Y'all know the standard, you know, Urban Decay packaging, blah, blah, won't do well. Um, so easy to get out of every last bit. Okay, airless pump. So it makes it easy to get every last bit of product. Okay, Urban Decay is 100% cruelty free if you guys are not already aware. And the fill weight says 28 milliliters, 0.95 fluent ounces. Okay, so just so y'all know what the description of the bottle. Hey, I don't think you're going to get it up here. There you go. Too tough. Mm. All right, and the regular degular schmegler price on the Urban Decay website is $36. I'm pretty sure it's also $36 at Ulta or Sephora as well, okay? But Jackie has the sample. I like the sample stuff before I put the, the money and invest in it and etc. 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 So with all that being said, all that beautiful stuff being said about you know about the background of um the illusion complexion primer, I will say everything that I read and described is is pretty much true because I this is my first time actually reading this. I've never read it. I was like, how can I come up here and get my beautiful's uh, uh, true review? And I don't have background on this product. So I never read it. I already had my thoughts and opinions before I read it. So here we go. Here's I'm just Jackie's thoughts and opinions. Okay. So like I said, goes on like a moisturizing lotion. I told you it dries down to, it. it, it, it is a matte finish. It dries down to a, a matte finish. It does have a slight cast but like i said over you know you let it sit long enough the the white cast it's not white i want to say translucent cast is gone okay now everybody knows the purpose of a primer a primer is you use a primer to uh you, you know um you know how you paint and you have the canvas you want to damn, prep the canvas that's it so Hey girl, you want to prep your canvas for when you get ready to paint your beautiful face. Okay, so at the end of the day, if you if you have issues with pores, like you have huge pores, um, maybe you have some blemishes or whatever that's that's not so smooth looking or etc cetera, etc. Cetera. Ironically, I had both at the time I was testing this out. I will say it definitely minimizes the pores. It definitely makes you. I don't. Have, I'm not wearing it today, by the way. I'm all, you, you guys will see another video with this face. Um, it definitely smooths out your canvas, smooths out your face to prep it for your face to beat your face. Okay, like the like I said, it goes on like a lotion. It's like a it's like a layer that smooths out everything so when you're putting on your makeup you can't see the blemishes you can't you can't see the um the magnified pores or or anything you know what i'm saying so and the skin still feels moisturized don't it don't feel dry or anything now i wore this all day every day last week um i was wearing it with powder powder foundation mainly my um my mac msf also the tart shape tape um and i did wear it a couple of times with the uh the mac waterproof foundation so overall it it honestly it did what it needed to do for my eight hour work day and, and then some i mean y'all know i have a combination skin so my t-zone is super 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 oily like the perimeter is is fine the perimeter is fine so the t-zone is where the oil and crap gets all cruddy and and just look sometimes i just be looking like i just grease my face up with vaseline i'm about to, about to fight you know what i'm saying so at the end of the day um of course you're going to produce oil it just depends on the person how much oil you produce throughout the day and then you know the primer um proper primers are oil blockers now some of them you know, ain't going to be able to block it to where you have no oil 
and you don't have to, you, you know, kind of dab your face throughout the day or whatever. But I would say I, I don't, I did not dab my face all throughout the day with this. Uh, I don't really check my makeup at work. I'm going to be honest with you. I sit there, I do my job, I keep it moving. You know, I go to the back, when I go to the restroom, I'll look, I'm like, oh, okay, I still look good with whatever. Now, I will say if I needed to dab, it will only be like one time a day. Um, you know, uh, when I got off work, I looked at my face. I said, oh, it ain't that bad. You know, it's normal shine buildup. But I don't want to say buildup because it wasn't a whole lot. Here's the thing. Let me put it like this. It looked like I was I was glowing or I had dewy skin or whatever. It didn't look like um, my skin was super, super, super oily and I needed to mattify it down with some powder or whatever, what have you. So anyway, I will say this. Um, I can't see myself paying $36 for a full size of this optical illusion. The only, only reason why is I don't, I don't, I just don't, I don't, uh, it's other primers that you guys know that I love a lot. And, you know, they're up in range too. They're up in the thirties or whatever, whatever. But, um, and then you, you know, I have my favorite drugstore brands too. I really don't pull for drugstore brands anymore. I really stick with the, the higher end, um, primers. Um, but I don't know. I love, uh, anyway, I, I, I just love a lot of different primers. Um, I'm glad this one does say it dries down to a matte finish. Um, I didn't realize that till I read it, but ironically, it, like I said, the, the finish was a good finish when you let the primer set an ample time before you, you know, paint your face. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know. I'm gonna have to keep trying this out a little longer, um, along with some other primers that I normally use. You know, throughout my whatever, how I feel day like what am i gonna put on my face today uh my lighting bitch you better get it together okay shit so anyway <laughs> i don't know what it's doing let me just stay here let me be still so where the hell so sunday sample urban decay optical illusion i will say definitely go get a sample girls go get a sample try it out for yourself y'all let i'm just jacking out how you feeling about it or whatever i like it but i just don't know at this point in time i want to invest in it so for me i will keep using this sample by the time i finish this sample and a little bit of this goes a long way by the way a little goes a long way so by the time i finish this sample i will have a decision in my mind if i want to buy the full size or if i'm going to go back and just get another sample so yeah and at some point i'll get tired of getting sample like girl just go buy the full size because you know you like it you keep going back and you get it you keep going back and you're getting it or whatever whatever y'all y'all know how this old bitty do i'll be hot flashing you know what i mean you know what i mean mm. so anyway if y'all are interested in this face whoo Stay tuned. Yeah, another video will be dropping soon. On this face, how I did this face. So anyway, go check it out, y'all. If uh, Listen, Lori, if you watch this video, I know you're Urban, De Urban Decay Queen. Let me know if you have tried this. Let me know what you think about it. And any other beautiful out there watching this video, if you already have it, if you're trying it, let me know how you feel about it. Let me know if you're going to try it. Y'all. Urban Decay gives you up to three samples Okay, because that's what I got today Because I was trying to get another one She's like, oh, we're going to give you up to three samples I was like, oh, no problem So let me just get these three and keep it keep it popping, keep it moving So now I know when I go back I'm going to have in mind what other three things I want to try out Because I'm going to get these samples And I'm going to keep giving my beautifuls my Sunday sample videos Okay, so anyway, beautifuls Hope this helps Let me know, you know And I catch my beautifuls in the next video do